people wouldn't um, hand over their children over a wall if, if it wasn't fueled by panic and, and just utter fear for their lives. This is how Brampton is helping Afghan refugees resettle in Canada. Since the Taliban took over the nation's capital last week, the Canadian government has launched a resettlement program expected to bring 20,000 Afghani citizens that have become targets after aiding the Canadian Armed Forces. Although the federal government has yet to announce exactly where refugees will live once they arrive, Brampton City officials have already begun to prepare for their arrival, a fight being championed by the Red Leaf Canadian Resettlement Organization. It is a fairly new organization. It was really in response to what's happening in Afghanistan right now. We're an organization that's trying to connect Afghan Canadians to the resources that are currently available through the federal government's Afghan resettlement program. As a refugee herself and a Canadian citizen currently living in Brampton, Saeed says she felt compelled to help family, loved ones and others trying to flee Afghanistan. I've had the opportunity to connect with a lot of uh, Afghans that are on the ground right now and it's, it's, um, it's chaos, there's a lot of fear, there's a lot of pain um, and there's a lot of anger. Um, imagine just waking up one day and everything you've planned for is, is no longer a possibility. With more than 200 refugees already registered for the program and more signing up every day, Saeed is hoping to garner more support for expanding the government's official resettlement program, hoping to include human rights advocates, LGBTQ plus individuals, journalists and other vulnerable groups with nowhere else to go.